Well, the good things in life, they're worth waiting for. After a bit of a delay, it's finally opening day for the Philadelphia Phillies. They're going to take on the Braves this afternoon on their home turf at Citizens Bank Park. And that's where we find Fox 43's Sean Stryker live in Philly with more on what fans can expect this season. Hey, Sean. What's going on, guys? Yeah, so it's a little chilly out here. It's a little breezy, but today the sun should be shining a little different than yesterday. So everybody's super excited to get the season started, including Bill Thompson, former player, coach, current team ambassador. Uh, how are you feeling today? How do we feel about this season? Excited. I think the fans will get us going early today, and uh, it's going to be a good day. You know, you're facing your top rival in, in the Braves, so... Uh, Nothing needs to be said. They'll be ready to go. I was going to say that because, yeah, the, obviously they've battled back and forth the past couple of years. Uh, the Phillies uh, took care of business in the playoffs. But how important is it to kind of start on that uh, in that win column, especially against the Braves? Well, the thing is you want to get off to a hot start. Uh, the last couple of years we kind of got off to a slow start and then we fought back. So it would be nice just to get out there and uh, – Start the uh, season off on a winning note. Uh, I always say 90 wins get you in the playoffs. That's 15 a month. So, uh, <laughs> That's some just, math for you, right? Yeah, it, is, it is 15 a month. You got 90 wins and you're in the playoffs. So the thing is now, you know, this team's built to get to the playoffs. But you know, we got to we got to find a way to finish the job. Uh, so the past couple of years, obviously, very successful for the Phillies, making it to the World Series and the, the NLCS. Uh, big signings, locking up some key pitching in the off season. How do you keep replicating? that success moving forward how do you uh, I guess keep your foot on the gas well I think you know uh, once you, you you feel it and you get into the playoffs it's it's it's, it's a, a good feeling and you find a way to uh, be motivated and, and get back there and get get the job done I mean every day out there that those guys are, are, are prepared and uh, they know what their jobs are you just go out and do your job do you have any uh, any like sleep what's your uh, sleeper pick what, what's your your uh, your dark horse this year for the Phillies anybody going to surprise us no not really all those guys are, are doing great I love the way Stott goes about his business uh, he, he has great at bats a boom those young guys are really starting to pick it up and, and finding a way you know you know what Harper's going to do yeah. so those guys there but the young guys are really starting to figure it out yeah, they, they, I mean, and they are still young, but you said they've been in they've been in the league for a couple of years now, so they uh, they got some seasons under their belt. Milt, thank you so much for joining us this morning. You're welcome. Stay warm because yeah, yeah. it is cold out here. All right, don't go anywhere because we have a ton to talk about. Yeah, we talk baseball, but we got some uh, some cool new additions to the ballpark coming up in about 30 minutes. We're talking about a brand new mural they put in here, and we're going to talk to the artist. So some cool things, whether you're more into the games or some of the uh, the atmosphere stuff as well. Oh, I'm excited for that. We'll check back in with you soon, Sean.